So this problem, they want us to solve this equation with fractions in it. And the best way to do this is to clear the fraction. Don't, don't try to keep fractions and find common denominators because it's, when it's an equation, meaning there's an equal sign, you can m much more simply just multiply the entire equation by the least common denominator, which is 6x. And this is different from when you're simplifying expressions and you're having to keep things balanced on the top and bottom. This is just keeping things balanced on the left and the right. So I'm going to multiply this 6x into all both sides of the equation, which means every term gets the 6x. When I multiply 6x times 2 times over 3x, the 6x and the 3x cancel, and you just get 2 times 2 right? That's what you'd have left. When I multiply the 6 times the 1 over 6, the 6's would cancel, mm -hmm. and I just get 1 times x. Oh, okay. And when I multiply the 6x times this side, the 3x cancel, and I just get 2 times 4, which is 8. 8. Okay. So your equation now is 4 plus x equals 8, which means x equals 4. And then you can check it by plugging it back in. And now, for some people, this is harder to do than the other thing. I'm not going to name names next, but 4 over 12. So this right here is just 2 over 12. So 2 over 12 plus 2 over 12 is 4 over 12. So it checks out.